Hi. <laughs> oi, 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 we didn't have a camera. You know, sometimes these things happen. Um, let me get us all set. You can hear me. We're gonna bump up the music a little bit. Thanks for being patient with me today, everybody. It was like, do I have to hook up my phone? Or what the heck is gonna happen today? Okay, I see myself, I see you. I hear myself, I don't wanna hear myself. Oh, welcome Joy, Tracy, Colleen, Dick, and all of the puppies. Uh, we will need pictures of the puppies. <laughs> we just, it is necessary. All right, so we've got a camera. Um, in other unfortunate news, we don't have a whole heck of a lot of uh, AC. <laughs> Unfortunately, the one I just spent the big bucks on, it's like, so I've got my hair pulled back. I've got my water, I have a sweat rag. This lump that you see in front of me is Flash, apparently he thinks it's cooler wherever I am. Um, I, just based on the fact that we have had a little technical difficulties today, I'm not gonna mess around with trying to put the timer on. Um, that said, I always try once, <laughs> so we'll see what happens. Um, today we're gonna do gentle interview, interviews and intervals, both of those things. How are you feeling today? post it in the chat. Um, we are going to go through not five rounds, but eight rounds of the same family of exercises. And within each round, remember we do the 20 seconds on, the 10 seconds off, for every 20 second sequence within the eight, we'll be doing a variation. So you won't be doing the same thing over and over again. For example, the first round, the theme is jumping jacks, but we're gonna do lots of variations of things that have to do with jumping jacks. Rebounds, if you will. All right, probably none of that made sense. We do need to get warm, and I've got four of these sets set up. I'm a little thrown off today, y'all. We'll get there, we'll get there. All right, oh my goodness. Take your drink. Let's stand and face our rebounder. Wide stance, we're gonna reach all the way up overhead. We're gonna bend our knees and fold at our hips and then stretch your arms out over the rebounder. And then from here, tilt your tail under and roll all the way up through the spine to the top. Let's do that again. Big stretch up, take an inhale if that feels good for you. Bend and stretch. Think of stretching the sides of your back and the sides of your spine. Like someone's pulling you and then as you tug up, you feel that resistance on the other direction. Big lift, big lower. Press it out, roll it up. One more time, big lift. Fold in your hips, bend your knees, reach. And from here, let's just stay for a minute. We're gonna bend our right knee and reach our right arm longer and straighten the left leg and bend the left arm in. So you're doing kind of a little crawl and then switch sides. Reach, feel inner thigh stretch, feel outer side of the body. Let's do two more of these slow. The quality of this movement is like a big old yawn, a big wake up stretch for your back body. Good, one more time. Reach. Good, all the way back to center. Bend both knees. Bring your hands right into the center of your mat and then curl your spine, round your spine. Push into your rebounder. Make sure your legs are nice and wide. Feel the stretch of your back. Lift your tail, bend your knees, reach your chest forward and feel the extension of your spine. We wanna get the spine nice and warm. Let's do it again, rounding. Pulling the front ribs up to the back, feeling those core muscles connect. Using your exhale to help and then reach all the way out. Good, nice work. Curl your tail under, roll all the way up to the top, roll those shoulders. Do it again. We're gonna roll them as we turn around. Roll those shoulders. Give me four more. And three. And two, we're gonna go two counts down in a squat, two counts back up. Here we go, down one and two, and stand. So I had the pleasure, if you guys follow me on Instagram, you probably saw my little video. We went roller skating yesterday. And I have to say, like for as much as I was afraid that my legs would be hurting today, I definitely feel the work, but it feels really good. Like a new, a new kind of, um, 
stimuli happened. And so we like it all the way up. One more time, down and all the way up. All right, let's step up on our rebounder. We're gonna stand just a little wider than hip width distance. Give me a few ankle rolls. So the rule is, as we go through, there's no rules, but you know, the guide post as we go through. I'm gonna give you, starting from the first interval we do, it'll be a very simple version of the exercise. One that's lower impact, closer to the mat, and pretty manageable for most folks. All right, let's reverse outside to inside with our ankle circles. Get those big circles so you get a lot of warmth in our ankle joint. As each piece progresses through the eight rounds, we'll add a little level of difficulty to it, more in the sense of coordination, balance to a degree, etc. Let's do two more. But the deal is, switch to the other side, rolling out. The deal is you get to choose which version works for you. So if we get to a point where we're going faster or we're gonna do a little direction changing here, nothing too huge. If we turn directions and you feel a little discombobulated, just go to the exercise that worked better for you. As you know, stay closer to the mat. That's always a good uh, modification. Let's reverse. The words are coming slow today. <laughs> I just want all those good knee, ankle, hip motions to be warm for all of us, even though I'm not gonna lie, it's pretty warm in here. <laughs> I can't win, I can't win. Oh, but I don't have the fan on. I might change that in a little bit during one of our rests. That's it, good. We'll go one more. Let's take our feet wide. I want you to just bounce down. So find that bounce. Feet are connected to the mat, knees are bent. Hips are underneath your rib cage. Ribs are over neath your hips. <laughs> Shoulders are wide, collarbones open. Think of reaching the crown of your head towards the ceiling, creating space between your ribs and your hips. Just a little bit of tension through your center so you feel connected. Bend those knees a little bit more. Just let your arms hang down for right now. We're gonna slowly scan, taking our gaze over our right shoulder. Find something, see something. Good, and then come back to center. I have to tell you, getting on those roller skates yesterday, oh my God, let's go to the other side. The first time I got on, my body was shaking, my feet didn't know where to go. Take it all the way to the left. Good, and then come back to center. After a little while, I got the hang of it, but it was it's interesting, you know, your, your nervous system goes, wait, let's take it over. And even something like changing directions, like at one point they turned the lights out and they had all these spinning lights and I was like, yeah, I'm done. <laughs> Come on back. I fancy myself a pretty adequate mover, but like some about those flashing lights. Let's take it left one more time. I was not sure if I was moving or the floor was moving. And then my son, you know, I'm, I'm doing like the very slow shuffle. Take it back to center. <laughs> Let's go into a little bounce balance, bend your elbows. Again, we're taking a few minutes to warm up. We're just about there. One more minute. My son just runs on roller skates, and if he falls, he falls. <laughs> it's like, I'm like, Ugh. he was just like, run, run, run the whole time. So it was fun. All those junior high memories coming streaming, streaming back. You gotta do things that make you like feel like a kid, you know? <sighs> and even my mother in law, who has enough issues body wise that probably skating isn't like the best thing she should do. She said, I just want to go around once. She rented her skates, she made it around once, had a great time, that was it, she didn't want to push it. Just like tapped into that like, my body still moves for me and as long as I respect it, it'll work for me, you know? <gasps> the fan just turned on. Yes, <laughs> give me a single, single double. Single, single, double. If you're wearing a heart rate monitor, I want you to check where you're at. You should be pretty, pretty low at this point. For most of us, it's gonna be you know, around the 90s, the early 100s. If you're finding you're pushing it up a little more, then just see if you can calm it down, deepen your breaths. So we're not to that work portion yet. You know, give me four more. Four, three, 
two, and one. We're gonna step tap to the right, to the left. Just get it going. It's the last few minutes of our warm up. All right, I gave you extra long warm up just because we wanna be able to, we're not trying to limp, leap up to the summit of the workout from the bottom. We're gonna climb, okay? Yes, good. Take these taps, and if it feels good for you, give me a little knee lift, knee lift. Good. All right, so our first round of eight is gonna be marches first, then we're gonna do some steps, then we're gonna do some slides, then we're gonna do some jumping jacks, we're gonna double up those jumping jacks, we're gonna do some wide bounces, some narrow bounces, and then we're gonna take it on the diagonal. You don't have to remember any of that, that's just for me to listen. Good, give me four more, three, two, one, good. All right, now is the chance to get a little drink. I'm gonna put that fan up, because we need it. We need it, we need it. We've got air. She'll be right back. She's coming. Gather up your courage, my friends. All right, let's wait for our next song to start, starting with our first round of eight. All right, we got it. So. Our first round is gonna be marches for 20 seconds. We'll break for 10, then we're gonna take it wider and in. I'll give you a cue. We've got 15 seconds left. If you wanna just march nice and easily, go for it. Once we start, remember we're going right through. Just a little break between each set. Five, four, three, two, march it out for 20. Come on, Flash. We got it, okay, bye. <laughs> Good. March it out. That's it. Good. It's all going to feel too easy at the beginning. Don't trust that. <laughs> Three, two, one. Ten seconds. Our second round. Watch. It's out, out, in, in, out, out, in. We go in five, four, three, two, out, in, out. So remember, if you need to go back to the marches, or the out, out, in, in at any point in time. It's all good, it's all you. Good. 10 seconds. Here comes that breath. Remember we were talking about trying to breathe through our nose a little more. And rest. Our third round is slides. Nice and simple. All right, we go in four, three, two, one. Out and in. Keep your legs close to the mat. Slide your feet out, slide your feet in. No jumps yet, that's coming. Let it be easy for yourself, 10 seconds. Open those arms. The goal is progression. So we're not going red line. Rest, 10 second rest. Instead, we're climbing, right? Our next one is a full jumping, jumping jack. Stay with the slide, stay with the marches. Three, two, one, go. Out and in. Stay on the beat or not. Just keep moving through those 20 seconds. We always think, oh, I can do anything for 20 seconds, but cumulatively, it gets a little more tiresome. Good, you got it. And rest. Our next round is doubles out, doubles in, okay? Two out, two in. Three, two, one, go. Out, in, out in that's it keep going Woo. 10 seconds stay with it feel it push three two one rest our next round is bounces all the way out to the side see how they all have something to do with the jack three two one stay right here bounce good work We've got two rounds after this one. So this is number six. Keep pushing down through the break. Good. I gotta turn the music up. I know it probably sounds good for you guys, but I can't hear it. Three, two, one. Stay there. Bring your flags closer together. Our next round, there we go, is narrow. Here we go. Ready? 
Legs together. Go. Woo. Made that work, didn't we? <laughs> we just like to do a little prayer to the trampoline powers that be. For five, four, three, two, one. Rest. Our last one. We're going to take it onto the diagonal, side to side. Breathe. Five, four, three, two, go. Out and in. Changing directions. Shift your shoulders, shift your hips. Slide it if you need to. There we go. Good work, good work. Almost there. Four, three, two, one. One round done. We did it. All right, quick drink, everybody. Do what you need. We got another round coming up. I purposefully put the more challenging uh, um, exercises at the beginning. So we kind of get them out of the way, meaning the bigger bounces. How are we doing? I love it, I love it. Oh, yay, yay, yay. Okay, everybody. So hot. <laughs> Canada. Low cold down here. No smoke though. <laughs> Today's like the clearest, cleanest day. I was like, yes! All right, our second round is takes on basic bounce. That's our hip width distance. Our first round, we're just gonna swing the arms and stay stationary on the mat. That's your baseline, you can always come back to that. We're going in just about 45 seconds. Our second round is gonna be bouncing. Our third round, we're gonna do our little beats. Then we're gonna do heels for the fourth. Then we're gonna twist it. Then we're gonna do side to side. And then we're gonna change a few directions, nice and slow. You can always stay close to the mat. All right, find that stance. About hip socket width distance apart. Knees reaching over your second and third toes. Bend your knees. Roll your shoulders back. Tiny little hinge of the hips. We go in 10 seconds. I know the rest seems like a long time, but guess what? You'll be happy for it. Five, four, bend your elbows at 90 degrees. Ready? 20 seconds. Slice those elbows back. There we go. Bend your knees a little more. I was like one beat behind the music. Keep weight in your toes. This is your simple. Just keep it moving. Woo. Three, two, one. Whatever you like for 10 seconds. Same thing on the next round. We're just bouncing, lifting our feet off the mat, if that's you. Go as fast or as slow as you want in three, two, and one. Good, here we go. The beat, there it is. I am a beat-driven teacher. I can't help it. <laughs> Woo! 10 seconds. Good. Three, two, one. 10 seconds rest. Our next one is beat. You're gonna tap your toe forward as you pull your elbows back, okay? On or off the beat in three, two, one. The way this one was taught to me is like, the, the doors are opening as your knee presses through. The doors are your arm. Knee walks through. Good. Ready, set, stop. Okay. Our next one is same thing, but heels. Step in heels. In five, four, three, two, one. Go heel, heel. Pull those toes all the way back. You know you can slide this. You know you can go slower. I just want to keep reminding you. Yes. Woo! Excellent. Five, four, three, two, one, and then one more for good measure. Good. 10 second rest. Our next one, twists. Stay close to the mat or jump it in three, two, one. 20 seconds. Twist that torso. You can twist on the balls of your feet, or you can jump. Love it. Good, 10 seconds. Four, three, two, one. Good, 10 seconds. Our next one, we're gonna go side to side. Also, sliding is fine, okay? Three, 
two, comes up so fast. Go. Boom. Yes. See, even at what might be considered a moderate pace for some, you can get your heart rate up high. Yes. You can work those muscles. Two, one, rest. All right. We're gonna take two basics. Turn to one side. Turn to the back. Turn to the side, turn to the front. Let's basic here. All right. Quarter turn to the right. Look then turn. Quarter turn to the back. Quarter turn to the right. Quarter turn to the front. Good. Stay right here. Four, three, two, and one. Rest. We'll do it to the other direction for our last round. All right, remember, see something, then turn your shoulders and hips. Three, two, give me your basic bounce. Good, ready? Quarter turn to the left. Quarter turn to the back. Quarter turn to the left. Quarter turn to the front. Good, three, two, one. Easy breezy. Second round, chef's kiss. Grab your drink, wipe your sweat, say a prayer, whatever you need at this moment. Beyonce. Dance party, just under a minute before we go into the third one. All right. Oh, loving the cool air. Loving it, loving it, loving it. All right, we're gonna go into our bounce balance one next. So we've got bounce balance variations starting with the bounce balance. We're gonna tap some knees, some ankles. We're gonna do a little pony. We're gonna turn our bounce balance. We've got 25 seconds left. All right, remember bounce balance is side to side. I want you to try to drop it low and attempt to get on the beat. Remember, it's only 20 seconds here, so push yourself for this one, and then we'll do what we need to do in the other ones. 10 seconds. All right, ready? Five, four, three, two, one. Go with me, 20 seconds. Bend your knees low, look at me. I'm hinged forward so I can get a little deeper into my heels. Strong connection to the core. Boom, 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 heel, 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 heel. That's it. Lower your hips a little more. Push, push. Three, two, one. First one done. We're gonna do knee taps right. Well, right hand to left knee, okay? And then that's just all right for 20 seconds. In three, two, one. Tap, tap, tap. Our next round is all left. Push it up. Think of using your core muscles to pull together. Five, four, three, two, one. 10 seconds. Ready for the other side. In five, four, three, two, one. Boom, boom. Push, push. Bend both knees. Go! I make some noise. Literal knee slapper. Bad joke, sorry. <laughs> In all the ways. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Boom. Dance it out for 10 seconds. Our next one, heel tap with the arm on the high diagonal. Ready? Three, two, one, go. Get that heel. You can't touch your heel. Get your calf, get your knee, get your thigh, whatever you can. 10 seconds left. Go, go. Five, four, three, two, one. Dance or just rest. Other side, arm goes on the high diagonal. We go for the heel in three, two, one. Tap, tap, good. Woo, kick that, use your push down to let that heel lift up, yeah? Good, 10 seconds. You gotta dance it, you gotta have fun. Good, three, two, one. All right, next one is the hardest one in this round. Great, right? We're gonna pony. 
tapping in the front, side to side. We go to the right in three, two, one. Jump, jump. You can also slide. You can also step tap. Whatever you need to do. Not enough time to explain sometimes. I think it's the hardest one. You're landing on one and a half feet instead of two. We're here for three, two, one. Rest. Bounce balance is next. We're gonna start to turn it. Find your bounce balance. And all we're doing, follow me, is taking it around to the right. Keep going around to the back. Keep going around to the left. I mean to the right, sorry. <laughs> and then all the way front. Stay here. Three, two, one. You can keep bounce balancing. You can take your rest. We're gonna go around the other way. Simple, simple. Last round in this section. Ready? Bounce balance. Left. Ugh, ugh. There we go. Start to turn it around to the left. Ooh, ooh. Short circuited. Turn around to the back. Good. Turn it around. Keep going. All the way back to face front. Good. And rest. That's it for the second one. Woo, it's a lot. Quick drink if you need it. Always a little one helps. All right. That's three. How are we doing for time? We're doing great. Our fourth one is all about jogs. Your base level jog is always gonna be a tiptoe, rolling to the ball of the foot, staying here. We'll go through low jogs close to the mat. We'll lift our knees up. We'll do some diagonal low, diagonal high. We're gonna do a couple soccer kicks. A step tap is always a good option. And then we're gonna do some kicks at the end, okay? If that's not for you, you can tap front, just slide and switch, or you can step tap. All right, last big push, 10 seconds left. We're doing great. Starting in parallel, tiptoe in four, three, two, find that tempo. Roll to the ball of the feet. Push, push, heel, heel. There you go. Yes. 10 seconds. This is just glide it along. Let those legs move underneath you. Three, two, one. 10 second rest. Our next one, we go little low jogs in three, two, one, go. It's gonna be a slow build. There we go. Keep your feet low to the mat. Keep your center strong. Do not lean back. A little bit forward over your hips. Under 10 seconds left. Four, three, two, one, rest. Third set, lift those knees higher in your jogs, knees facing front. In five, four, three, two, one, up, up. Good. Here we go. Boom, boom. Run. Good work. The best little jogging song there is. Five seconds. Breathe, stay focused. Two, one, rest. Our next one, we're gonna do some low jogs in a V. You can also tiptoe this. Are you ready? Three, two, one. Just keep them low, keep them low. Good, work on that connection. A little more ribs in the front to pelvis. A little less in the back. Go ahead, 10 seconds. Just keep it going, push down, push down. Move those hands. Three, two, one, rest. Next round, knees high, okay? Woo! -hoo. Five, four, three, two, lift those knees. Woo hoo! Yes. Breathe it. You got it. Just let that beat drive you through. Under 10 seconds. We're five, four, three, two, one. Stay slightly turned out. Our next one is soccer kicks. 
Imagine that you're kicking the ball up, okay? Arms out to a T, ready, set, go. Strong here, no leaning back. Step touch, remember? Good. Woo! Get it, get it. That's it, that's it. Four, three, two, one. All right. Our final two are kicks. Slide, step tap, or kick it. Arms out to the side, we're going front. Join me, ready, set, go. That's it. I'm pointing my feet because I'm a dancer. You can flex your feet, that's fine. Good, 10 seconds. Good work, everybody. Five, four, three, two, one. Rest. Last set. Step tap to the side. Slide to the side or kick them out to the side. In three, two, one. Woo! Go. Lots of breath today. Good. 10 seconds left. Go. Yes. Woo! Good. Three, two, one. Good. Give me a high bounce. Nice work, everybody. That was it. Can you believe it? Can you believe it? I love it. Good. All right. Breathe. Let's start to scissor slow. We're just gonna take a little loft. Calm our heart rates down. We'll get one more chance for a little rest in a moment. Good. That's it. Good. Four, three, two. Let's go into some jumping jacks slow. Just let it go. Arms can be floppy if you like. Just keep control of yourself in the center. Make the bounce feel good. More like fun, less like exercise. Even though exercise feels good. It's a little less focus behind it. We're gonna land in the center. Hands down by your side. High bounce in the center. Stay in that center. Bouncing straight up and down. You got it. Good. All right. Widen those feet out, side to side. Bounce, balance, slowing it down. Just letting out any of the kinks that we don't need anymore. Really good work, everybody. Both heels come down, bend those knees, big breath in. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. I know taking a long breath is hard. Do your best. If you need to take two, you can. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. Good. Slow down the bounce all the way. A little rotation to turn out with your feet. Take your hands down on your knees. Come forward into a flat back. Knees bent, we're gonna do the same thing we did at the beginning. Round your spine, curl your tail under, and then extend your spine, lift your tail up, lift your chest up. Again, round your spine. Good, Urgh, extend. Ooh, I got a red face right now, round. Yes. Good, and extend. Excellent, and round to stand up all the way to the top. Let's go ahead, if you wanna do this standing off to the side using your rebounder as a support, you can step down or use the wall. If you wanna stay up here with me, that's perfect. We're gonna have our left, our right foot forward, our left foot back. Flex your right foot, hinge at the hips. Good, take your hands onto your left knee, pull your toes back, stretch that calf. Woo. Good. We're gonna shift our weight to the front leg, bending the front knee. Tuck your tail under. Ooh, there's those calves. <laughs> Good. Take your same arm as back leg up. Little stretch over. Uh, big reach. Yeah! Come on, all the way back, switch sides. Flex your front foot. 
hinge at your hips. Stretch. Good work, everybody. Shift your weight forward, find that lunge. Tuck your tail under just a little bit to get a little more stretch in the front. Big stretch over. Come on, all the way up. We're gonna gently step down off of our rebounder. We're gonna do a little quick, take the sweat out of the eyes. All right, yellow labs, OMG. Take your left ankle on top of your right knee, press down and find your stretch. Good, if it's possible, you can also bring your hands to the frame and kind of pull yourself into that stretch. Both work equally as good. Outer hip stretch, remember, try not to be collapsed in our upper body. Good. If you're here and you can cross your leg over comfortably, cross your leg over. If not, just take it right down next to the other one. Keep your left hand back, take your right hand around, and just take a twist over to the left. Yes. Feel your spine turn with your inhalation. Lift up a little taller. Good. Come back to center, uncross, other ankle on top. Sit nice and tall. It's telling me I'm working out. Yes, yes we are. I <laughs> just noticed, just noticed right now. Thanks. Thanks for nothing. Watch. Good. Stay there for one more second. I'm going to, I'm going to bring us down a notch in our music. This is all super fun, but we want to start to take it down a little, don't we? Yes, we do. There we go. Uh, 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 uh. Cross that knee over the other one or put it right beside. Gentle twist. You know, when we're twisting, there's kind of two ways to go about it. You can kind of, some people feel more twist if they feel like their spine is shrinking and turning. Some people feel more if they feel like their spine is lengthening and turning. So play around with it yourself. But just the rule of thumb is don't force it. Good work. All right, come back. Open those legs, elbows come forward and press your knees out. Breathe. Trying to get all those rebounding muscles today. Good. Come back to center. Just take your feet, perch forward onto the rebounder. Take your feet a little wider. We're going to do like a yogic ish thing just to move that spine one more time. So big breath in, lift up, reach over, and then we're going to do a flat back dive forward. Press your arms open, sail all the way down. Reach your hands in front of your toes and just let yourself hang there for a moment. Good, now peek up at me, lift your chest. Flat back comes all the way up, overhead, and then lower down. You can do that a couple more times. So big breath in, create space on both sides. Dive forward, open, kind of similar to a sun salutation. I'm not trying to make yoga happen on a trampoline. Don't worry about it. And then flat back, reach chest forward, and bring it all the way back up. Don't come after me, yoga police. <laughs> We're just doing a hip hinge, last time. Do they exist? Legend has it, all the way forward. Good, lift your chest up. Just a nice way to get back into those hips after they've been used a lot. Okay, slide back. Enough so that you can support yourself with your hands and one foot comes forward. I've got my left one up, or your left. Circle the ankle. If it's ucky, on your knee, you can do it a different way. You can do it on your back. Good. And reverse. All right, so this week I'm talking about a theme within my clients, both online and in person. We're talking about just having an inventory. I know, Colleen, we talked about this in the capable daily practice. Let's do two more here. It's a, it's a practice of checking in. And let's switch sides. You can go about this two different ways. 
one of the ways, let's circle, is to think, okay, what, what am I capable of today? Like, what's my energy look like? A deepening question might be, what am I equipped to support today? Is it strength building? Let's reverse our circles. Am I, do I have the resources to support a mobility session? Do I have the resources to support just like a mental health walk? <laughs> or maybe a recovery day? Just checking in, like what's, what do I have today? Because you know, on the days where you don't have it and you push it, sometimes it works out. Sometimes you need the extra nudge, let's rest. But a lot of times, it's adding, I don't want to say injury, but insult to injury in the sense of like, you know, your body's asking for rest and recovery and like recalibration or something that's not intense and you're forcing it to do something intense, which in some ways can build some resilience, but is that the resilience that you really want for your life? Do you want to be armoring for your life or do you want to be prepared and ready to meet it with resources? I'll let you decide. Shift forward, let's stand up together as a group, as a community. Three, two, one. Woo! How are you feeling? I'll check in with the chat. All right, you all. Um, tomorrow is the big day for the Eventbrite Reconvene Accelerator announcement. Uh, my hopes are medium. <laughs> I've got big things on the horizon that I'm focusing on. Got to keep moving forward, invest in some cautiously optimistic hopes understand that these things are out of your control, but also feel ever so grateful for all of you who are showing up as usual. If you wish to contribute to my channel, you can do it through Venmo, you can do it through my website. It worked! But most importantly, ask yourself always why the moves matter to you today. That's the most important thing that you can absolutely do. Helps to build our habits. Stay tuned for more. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, I'm having faith too. I'm a little feared to have faith. <laughs> Joy, I'm a little like, all right, I need, I need a nice even keel. Um, lastly, stay tuned for Thursday's class. Um, I just don't know where it's gonna happen from. We are, uh, we're tentatively gonna just take a little respite. So I just gotta find out what the details of that look like. We need it, we need it, you need it too. All right, happy August, which is tomorrow. Bye-bye, July. Thank you for being here with me. You are everything. Have a good week. <laughs>